connect to my virtual classroom. Okay, children, what can you see in the screen? Yes, nutrition, right? So you can see carbohydrates, minerals, vitamins, and fat food, what are them, and uh, proteins and everything is there. So what can you see about the picture? And uh, please tell me what sort of a lesson you are going to learn today. That is about nutrition. Okay, we are moving to the textbook now. Right, so see, in your book you have um, yes, you have this lesson. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Right. So, it's a saying, right? An apple a day keeps the doctor away. What do you mean by that? By eating only apple. Is that so? No. By eating, eating fruits, you can keep away with sicknesses and diseases, right? So, so, you don't need to meet the doctor if you are having healthy nutritional food. Right, we'll see. Now, see, in your book, you have given a circle. In that circle, you have uh, they have mentioned you fruits and vegetables. Some pictures are there. And uh, bread, cereal and potatoes. There are some pictures. And milk and dairy foods also. You can see some pictures. Uh, foods containing fat and sugar. And pictures are available. Meat, fish and eggs. Okay, so today we are going to uh, learn about what are the nutritional food. Is our diet is nutritional or not? We will see at the end of the lesson. Okay, we'll start. Food is an important part of our lives. Is that so? Do you need food for our lives? Yes, we need food. There are five main nutrients in the food we eat. So, how many nutri nutrients are there? There are five. Okay. They are carbohydrates, vitamins and minerals, proteins and fat. So, what are the five items? See, it's there in the text, right? Cereals like rice and wheat and yams like sweet potatoes and manioc have carbohydrates. Okay, we'll see wheat. What do you mean by wheat? Uh, wheat, uh, right. We will see from the English dictionary, wheat means? Yes, annual low. Uh, vineyard grass have erect flowers, spikes and light brown grains. Okay, uh, shall we just... Uh, See it from picture di dictionary, yes, this is wheat, right? Okay, so from this uh, read to me app, you have these uh, options like translation word, picture dictionary and things. You can easily go through it and find out what other words are. Actually, I have to tell you the fact that in your phones, you have Google Play Store. You can download this read to me student edition and make it a point to uh, go through those lessons and you can learn le uh, learn a lot for English language from this read to me app. Okay, that is for your extra knowledge, right? I'm going through the lesson. So, I was discussing about wheat and yams. Yams means it's kind of a potato, right? So, yams like sweet potatoes and manioc. Okay, I'll show you a picture of a manioc, right? So, Yes, this is manioc. So, what can you see in the screen? Yes, in Sinhala, we call it as, yes, manioc, right? Okay, now you know what manioc is. Now, we are moving to the, uh, yes, lesson, right? So, have carbohydrates. So, here in the book, it says the ideas that what are the food items which contains carbohydrates, right? Uh, okay. While foods like milk, fish, eggs, beans, dal and bram have proteins. So they have given you what are the foods that contain proteins and what are the foods that contain carbohydrates, right? Milk and dairy foods. What do you mean by dairy foods? That means... Uh, 
milk means you know what milk is kiri kiri sa kiri ashrita nishpadan in singhala right foods like cheese butter and yogurt have fat while fresh vegetables and fruits as well as green leaves have vitamins and minerals so in the book there there we are discussing about what are the things are there in protein and what are the things are there in carbohydrates and what are the things are there in vitamins and minerals these nutrients are very important for many reasons i all taking nutritional food for your diets you have to uh you have to have those things because it's needed for your life we'll see why is it carbohydrates and fat give us energy uh, while proteins help us grow so you should know what are the things important for our growing and what are the things which are important to have energy within us right vitamins and minerals are important to fight diseases and to protect our body what do you mean by diseases we'll see uh, another word for disease yes that means an impairment of health or condition of abnormal functioning disease means another word sickness we can say like that right so here it says that vitamins and minerals important to fight diseases and to protect our body so is vitamin and minerals are important yes they are important to our life you should drink plenty of clean water because it helps in digesting the food okay you should drink plenty of water i all drinking water plenty of water is what is important to our life so so much of uh, so much of important thing to our life is water as a person as an elderly person it says uh, it says that you have to drink six bottles of water uh, per day for an elderly person that means water plays an important role for our healthiness right so vitamins and minerals are important important to fight diseases and protect our body you should drink plenty of water because it helps in digesting we'll see what do you uh, sorry what do you mean by digesting yes it's a verb convert food into absorbable substances i cannot digest milk products so there are people who can't digest milk product because they are uh, some sort of a problem is they are with the milk products when they use milk products for some of them like allergies and all right so digesting is in the sense we will look at it from a translation word yes jirane right we will look at it from the tamil um, translation also right see so um, in uh, digesting the food and you should also stay away from fast or junk food what do you mean by junk food actually nowadays we also feel very lethargic to prepare food which uh, actually to prepare some food we need lot of time because of that we are used to junk food junk food in the sense it's very easy to prepare for example your famous thing like noodles right so those things you also very fond of and it's very easy for you to prepare but is those junk food is it possible for you to uh, is it good for you to uh, have no because it's not good food because they are harmful to our body what do you mean by harmful another word for harmful we will look at it from english dictionary harmful in the sense causing uh ca uh, causing a pa uh, capable of causing harm too much sun is harmful to the skin harmful effects of smoking right that means harmful it's not good it's destroying another word is destroying to our body we must eat healthy food for breakfast lunch and dinner and as all the doctors say we must eat healthy food for breakfast lunch and dinner those are the three meals that we get breakfast lunch and dinner so these for these three meals you have to 
have a nutritional food, right? The doctors say to be healthy, we should have our breakfast like a king and dinner like a beggar. So what is the doctor's advice for us? To be healthy. If you want to be strong and healthy, what you have to do? We should have our breakfast like a king. What do you mean by like a king? A king means? Yes, king, you know what king is. Okay, we'll uh, translate the word, what it is. In Tamil, it's, uh, it's this. And uh, what is the Sinhala one? We'll see. Yes, Rajatuma. We should have breakfast like a king and dinner like a beggar. Okay, what do you mean by beggar? We will see it from English dictionary. Yes, uh, a, a pauper who lives by begging. That means a poor person is a beggar, right? So you have to eat uh, breakfast as a king, but uh, eat dinner as a beggar. That means poorly you have to eat, right? So here it says the last sentence is very important. A secret, the best food is what your mother prepares in her kitchen. Is that so? What is the best food? Your mother prepares in your kitchen. That is best fruit, right? That is the best food we can eat, right? So now look at the book. Here in activity 6, you have to do it for homework. Read and fill, uh, fill in the table. See? So the nutrient. What do you have to do with the help of the uh, with the help of the description given in the uh, the previous page? You have to write here what is the nutrient. That means here you have to write carbohydrate, protein, vitamins, minerals. Like that way, you have to provide what are the nutri nutrients. Then uh, in the next column, what you have to do? Use, uses of nutrients. Okay, we'll see what do you mean by uses. Just look at it from uh, dictionary. Uses means put into service, make work or employ for a particular purpose. What is the purpose of this? Or oh, for uh, its inherent and natural purpose. So use means the purpose. Use of nutrients. What are the food items? For example, here you can write Nutrients, carbohydrate, what sort of a food item? Bread is there, right? It's given in the book. Write that way. Protein, what are the food items? Right. Before move, uh, before ending up the session, I have to tell you, yes, today we were discussing about what uh, we were uh, uh, discussing about what you have to uh, eat for your Healthiness. We were discussing carbohydrates. Can you please tell me what are the food items that contains carbohydrates? Yes, the first one is food. Uh, for example, it's there. It's in the book also. Sweet potatoes, manioc. I show you a picture. Yes, manioc. Those things. Sweet potatoes, manioc, yams, rice. Those things are there in carbohydrates. Right, so what are the food items that contain, right, uh, what are the food items that contain uh, vitamins? Mm, go through the uh, description and see vitamins. Mm. Yes, see, green leaves, fruits, fresh vegetables, those things have vitamins and Mineral, minerals, right. So for proteins, what are the food items? Can you please tell me what are the food items for proteins? There is milk, dairy food, cheese, you know what cheese are, butter and yogurt, right. So those are the food items for proteins. So is nutrition important to our life? What sort of idea you have regarding that? Is it possible to have nutrients or it's uh, we can just eat junk food and stay safely. No, I was telling you junk food or fast food is not good for us. We have to have a healthy, if you want to have a healthy life, we have to have nutritional foods, right? So, uh, yes, okay. What do you mean by digesting? I was mentioning to digest the food. What you have to do? You have to drink 
ample full of water plenty uh, plenty of clean water you should drink to what to uh, uh, to digest food you should also stay away from fast food i told you it's harmful for our body okay children today we were discussing about what we were discussing about nutritional food items the uses of nutritional food items to our day to day life so i hope you enjoy the lesson regarding an apple a day keeps the doctor away okay we will be meeting soon with a new lesson to you thank you for listening and have a nice day